So now we're actually going to do episode 2 since I completed episode 1, or should have, when this is, well, yeah. Yes, fortunately. It seems that the car turned out to be too heavy. One of the arches must have been rotted. That was a close one. Anyway, how rude of me. Attorney Charlie Bowman. Jack Twain, pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you too. It seems that for this moment, we can do nothing about it. Tomorrow I will show you another way down. Now it's too late. Besides, the high tide blocked the road. How come? Are you saying that every now and then this place is completely cut off from the rest of the land? Exactly as you're saying. It happens from autumn to spring, as if winter wasn't enough. Nobody has even mentioned it. Such an interesting place, really. Anyway, shall we continue our conversation in the mansion? It's getting darker and colder in here. Of course, I understand. Do you think I can't live it like this? No problem. I suppose there's nobody but me and you on this island. Even if there was a robber, he wouldn't be able to get out of here by car. He would be trapped here with us. Well, let's go then. I allowed myself to lighten up the interior a bit and light the fireplace to make this place nicer for our conversation. Soon as the rightful owner, you will have to take care of it yourself. You're probably right. Quite a huge space to take care of. Oh yes, the number of rooms is almost frightening. But for this moment, most of them are not usable. When was the last time somebody lived in here? Officially, a few years ago. It took some time before someone has decided to regulate the legal status of this land. Is there anything else I should know? I suppose this, that and the other should be found. Probably you don't know much about the history of this manor. I can tell you something about it with pleasure, but not now if you don't mind. I think both of us are tired. Tomorrow, right after some breakfast, we can go through the papers and I will gladly answer all of your questions. Will that suit you? It's fair enough. The answer's no, you're probably gonna die. I must admit I didn't expect such a mess. The space is incredible. Tomorrow, right after going through formalities, I'll be pleased to show you around. And there's a lot to be seen. Now excuse me for a moment. I need to use the toilet. In the meantime, feel free to go to the room on your right. You can look for the documents I prepared. Right. I'll be waiting.
right direction, yes. No? Alright then. Hmm. Interesting. That may be the Slender Man. That's some kind of symbol. I'm supposed to find out more about it later on. Pick up that oil for some reason. Virtual murder in all matter. Okay, so it's oil and oil lamps, so it's kind of like, excuse me, I don't need it, but alright. Creepy hallway. Weird screen. Oh, can I take the gun? Excellent. Good statue. Wait a minute. There's a hand there. You're missing a hand. Oh. Face them, but do not turn away from them. Okay. So back here, I'm gonna do a thing I should have done a long time ago, and fucking run out of here. press the record button after I did that. But I was to get through them in a way I'll probably show you again after it. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much you just run and when you're walking out the door of the uh, place where you first enter the bathroom you just keep looking down the hall that your face as you're running. And as long as you face there they shouldn't they shouldn't kill you. So you should be fine. And then you run in here, two dogs appear there, you shoot them, you go up to the gate, the gate will close. 